And we're cleaner. We made it. All right, so it's Tuesday. Should be uh, in a publisher's best interest to make a good Switch version considering the popularity and how the game sells better there. Uh, yeah. 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 How many games sell better there? Yeah, like, the thing is, is it's in their interest to do a good Switch port, but I think that there's also a lot of developers that aren't... Like, one of the problems, I will say, with PC games is oftentimes they're not well optimized. And because they're not well optimized, like, the dev just does not know how to correctly optimize for the Switch, or uh, oftentimes the budget's already been spent, so optimization is, like running on like a shoestring budget right and because it's running on a shoestring budget uh or it wasn't a priority it's suddenly it's suddenly um it's suddenly you know have it's it's not getting fully it's not done getting done correctly or getting done to the uh utmost quality that it should uh just ask the current market in japan it's switch or nothing in terms of traditional market mm. yeah like the PS5 and the Xbox uh, are both like really going through it right now. Uh, it's not not great. Mm. There we go. Okay, so we gotta we gotta clean fast. Okay, we made the narr narrator sad. Um, we're gonna just. We gotta do the. We gotta clean fast. Okay, so that mess is like we gonna have to wait on that one for a while. So. Oh. That sucks. You. What the hell's wrong with people? There is an achievement for having uh, another co-worker see a body, so I guess I'm gonna do that. Oh my god. This is, this is how this is going down. <laughs> body found! There we go, there's another achievement. Mm. One of my achievements popping on stream. Uh, I should fix that. Oh my god. Okay, well, that's two achievements down right away. Um, properties. There we go. There. I don't think Code would handle, would handle it as a real janitor. Mm, probably not. I mean, I've worked jobs where uh, doing janitorial work was part of the job, but it wasn't the focus of the job. I mean, I am a very clean person, so I mean, like, I could see, like, being, um, you know, like, I'm very particular about things. I would do a very thorough job, I think. Hmm. Yeah. Crime scene cleaner is so good. Oh. gonna be able to get in here. There we go. This is perfect. Perfect timing, actually. Mm. There we go. Let's get out of here. That was really clean. Walked in that one. I'm sorry, everybody. <laughs> I think that could be. Hmm. It was really clean. That's gotta be five star. Yep. Nice. Five star and no kills. Yeah. 
uh, drops us right into the next stage. I don't think we need to do stage three. All right, own it. Fair. Mm. Actually, you know what? I just realized something. Mm. Uh, do, 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 do. There we go. That makes more sense. Have have the vacuum. It's weird that it's like glared in the background. I should probably did something about that. Um. Yeah. Okay. So let's take a look at our achievement list here. Let's see, that brings us up to 56%. It's gonna be a pretty quick list, so I figured doing a little bit tonight... Uh, doing a little bit tonight would be kind of nice. Um, okay, so something we have to do, which I didn't do much of... Um, here, let's look at the list. We'll get it together. Uh, we have to kidnap a co-worker, which I haven't done... Uh, what happens on stage 6? What happened on stage 6? Um, I don't remember, but it was an adventure. Um, so we have to um, kidnap a coworker. I think it was just so your star ratings like entirely based on time. So I think it just took a really long time on that stage. I think that's all. You have access to the whole uh, whole uh, company at that point, so it's like the whole building. That you have to navigate around uh, and there's a lot more co-workers so if i've uh, still trash ball i don't hmm i'll have to see about that one uh, make your one of your co-workers throw away four trash balls in the same level that's funny um uh, okay let's let's just like aim for our times right now is that's that's a good thing to prioritize. Um, but yeah, this is a cute little game, and it's also totally free. So if you're just looking for a little, once again, a little bit of flavor or something, uh, yeah, I definitely recommend the wear cleaner. It's very seasonal. It's good vibes. The ending actually made me laugh because I didn't see it coming at all, and uh, it got a pretty, pretty hard laugh out of me. And I still thinking about it now. And also, yeah, they're they're like their socials. They have um they have a little web comic that uh, has characters from the game, and it's very cute. And sometimes they make a for some reason. <laughs> Don't want that. Um. Okay. Um. Backing everything up. Um. But anyway, so. How y'all doing? Hmm. Oh. That room's a little on fire. A trash bag! Oh, never mind. That did not happen. Uh, we're still on time. Oh, you get- okay, I have to be like way more like particular about the trash bag. I wonder how that affects our score. Because <laughs> what- as far as I know, I think it's just time-based, so as long as we're like on time, it should be fine, right? I'm just like... Oh, you actually have to make sure you eat the bodies. Okay. Mm. Okay. Okay, let's go up here first. We just need to... You didn't see anything. Um, we just have to figure out which thing... Which sequence to do things in. 
So right away the servers are like basically totally accessible, so let's let's do them first. Let's go down here and clean up this mess. Um, anyways, this game is really cute. And I was like, yeah, I definitely want to do more of the achievements. Oh, shit. Seriously? I don't think I realized anybody even comes to this room. Uh, okay. Well. But yeah, I don't know if they're planning on doing a bigger version of this game, but uh, what I've played of this one, it's quite good. There we go. Um, uh, no. Uh oh. It's fine. We're good. A little bit of stealth is a treat. There we go. Fuck. But it's it's fine actually, it's great. It should be, it should be good. I mean, I only, it was only in the last lag that I kind of stumbled a little bit. Nice! So, there we go. Okay. Let me see if I, let's see if we can figure out how to, like, Oh yeah, okay. That, there we go. That's how you kidnap workers, then. So this is a... I can't believe this... Wow, this person's focused. <laughs> There's like a thing for getting like five of them at a time. There we go. <laughs> Alright, five of them done. Let's restart that stage. Um, okay, let me take a look here. Hmm. This also looks like a pretty fast, easy clear for achievements, so... Um... Play the arcade machine during level 5. Can we go over to the arcade machine? Oh, there's actually a whole achievement for kidnapping every worker in level 3. Just one sec. Let's, let's go do that. Kidnap or suffocate? No, we're just kidnapping. Every worker? Seriously? Oh, okay, so we, yeah, it's, we just have the office here. One. Two. That was really close. Three. Four. Um. You didn't see anything. Five. Six, seven, there we go. Blackout. Knapped every worker. Okay. Friday! Hmm. Okay, let's see. Okay, that side is locked out. Oh, it's this state. Oh, this state. Oh, yeah! There's a stage where, um, Kyle decided to release snakes into the, um, into the, um, office to catch the, the animal he thinks is wandering around. 
I say Kyle. Um, Daryl, yeah. Basically, the um, the security guard is aware that um, something's going on, but he's not sure what. And he thinks there's just like an a, a wild animal roaming the offices. See nothing. <laughs> I'm just gonna do my work then. This is what you call particularly fast. Who did this? Who drove this forklift around and crashed? I want to play a forklift simulator. I want to learn how to drive forklift. I think I would be good at it. Probably a little slow on that one for five star. Mm. <laughs> yeah, from Shenmu. Ah, uh, yeah, as would say. So we need to shave off like 30 seconds. How do we shave off 30 seconds from this? I don't think. Show the snakes is hard. Wait, oh, I went to the next stage. It's like, wait, they're not in... Hmm. Yo! That is not forklift certified. I want to be forklift certified, though. Hmm. As a person. You know, I desire it. We have dreams, you know? I want to be, I want to be mm, the first forklift certified cat girl in space. Mm. I don't think that's too big of an ask. Okay, so anyways. I mean, it might have been faster, honestly. Uh oh. Man, this is not going well. <laughs> So anyways, I guess if you play- there's an arcade, you can play- you can play- Oh, Cute. It makes a Pac-Man. 
That's fun. That's, that's really cute. Yeah, it's kind of funny because it's just it's just as much whether like Daryl sees who sees him as it is um, as it is actually like getting seen. Body phantom. No, don't do that. Oh, but... It's fine. We're playing Pac-Man. That's very, that's very cute. Y'all should pick those up. Where, where's the rest of the, oh no. Oh no, I'm chain killing. Oh, that's not good. Where's the rest of the dots at? Oh my god. Mm. Mm. It must it must have like yeah. Yeah, screaming says it off. Must must stop it if you've eaten. Oh no, there's one dot there. trash balls. Got it. So, just like Pac-Man, we ate all our enemies. I guess they're not enemies, they are co-workers. Okay, let's try, try this again. I figured if we failed, we'd just, like, do the Pac-Man achievement. Mm. Anyway, so... Everybody is doing well. Get that in a moment, cat. Um. If it just cut through the kitchen, it might be a little faster. Clean up this end of the warehouse. Or the, I guess this is back room pantry. I don't know what this is. <laughs> Perfect. Perfect play if I do say so myself. We did okay, we did okay. Hmm. We did it! I think that was under two minutes and... Nice! Just under two. Hmm. Okay, we're getting close to our... Our, uh... Getting close to having all our stars. Only two stages left, so... Oh, unfortunately, banana knife is not a candy. Neither is that coin, even though that kind of does look like a candy. Yeah, great extraction, thank you. I just got a vacuum from the door. There's a paper ball, you should get it. 
fool! Ha! Oh yeah, I got the trash ball back. Okay, so we did, didn't achieve an accidentally. going on over here. Oh, okay. Mm. Okay. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. That's what he says. Yo, rubber ducky. into the wall. Mm. There we go. Okay. So it seems like a good strategy for that section. I think that was pretty fast. Mm. Eat the CEO. We can. Uh, there is an achievement for, for watering the CEO while he's uh, asleep. Literally eat the rich. Don't worry, they do. Okay, so I think this next one. Oh. All right. The trash bags are probably too good, honestly. They're really, really strong once you start using them. Oh my god! Okay. That was a little intense. Okay, I think. Do they remove them at all? I don't know. I feel like they do, but I think it takes a little bit. Oh, what? <laughs> Two seconds too long. Had we not got stuck in that one spot, probably would've been fine. Do this side first. <laughs> eh, don't mind me. We'll try and do it like back, mm, backwards maybe. Mm, man, this is the section is really busy. You do ha there is like a sweet spot for the range, but it's not that hard to hit. Oh. 
Like, if you're a little too close, you'll attack, and if you're a little too far, you'll miss, but... Honestly, the very... I think we had the right idea the first time, where it's like, do this side first. But, yeah, no. It seems like you're given lots of freedom. Very cute. It's not like a hard game, but it's like it's cute. I'm enjoying my time playing in the office. Oh um. uh, yeah, that was just like way too gutsy. Too gutsy. Too much. Mm. Mm. That's Daryl. He's the security guard. He's the one that thinks shit's going down. Something's up. Which he would not be- oh yeah, you can even just walk right into them. He would not be wrong. But we mean well, that's the important part. Oh, mm. That's unfortunate. This is definitely- the last two stages are gonna be the hard ones. to get that five star. This is a very cute game though, like seriously. You know what it reminds me of a little bit? It reminds me of uh, that Roomba game we played a while back where it's like the concept itself is like simple, but it's like, it's just fun. It's just a good time. Oh, yeah, I forgot there's snakes. Yeah, the bags have some range, too. Hmm. All right. Hmm. Uh-oh. They should. Ooh, that was really close. They should really have a cap on the bags. I think that's probably. Uh, ooh. <laughs> probably something that should exist. Sneak in next to her, but I don't want to risk it. That was really close. They all going down. Yes. Hell yes. Perfect timing on this. Just gotta get out. Mm. Come on, that's gotta be it. Mm. Yeah. Four whole seconds of spare. Mm. Then we just got the final stage, which is when things get really, really wild.
Oh yeah, there's the CEO. Um, but we're helping. Hmm. Oh jeez. Uh, do you think he's gonna like check? Uh, don't check the stall, please. <laughs> check the other stall, please. Oh my god, that worked. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, he's blocking the stall. <laughs> oh my god. Just do it. Just do it. Oh, he got us. Daryl got us. See you never. Oh, damn. No pay. I was, I was being too. I was dancing around it too much. Running it too hot. Running it too hot. Too sexy. Okay, maybe not too sexy. So it causes all these deaths. Uh, the, the the employees, they're not they're not happy. The rebellion. Hmm. The the plot is that the boss, the CEO, is having them work like uh, uh, a week of unpaid uh, overtime. So close. <laughs> oh shit. Don't go back. There we go. Okay. You didn't see anything. Oh. <laughs> mm. oh. Oh god. Oh, the pizza. Oh shit. You can tell the fucking. CEO bought them a pizza and threw a fit. Holy shit. I am a lover of pizza. Pizza is no, no replacement. The worst pizza is an apology pizza. Ugh. Oh, are you kidding? That's okay. It might still be good. It might still be okay. Just gotta... Pay the bills on pizza, exactly. <laughs> there. <laughs> go to the ma- oh, go to the mascot room, I forgot about that shit. Uh, we're not- Oh, uh, fuck. Uh, 
This has got really hectic. Um. Right. There we go. Yeah, that's not gonna cut it. That was that was a lot of a lot of extra extra stuff that we had to do there. It's not a very good security guard uh, in the end. Well, no, because well. <laughs> I like how I like how bitter he is. <laughs> I think that's like part of what makes it. You know what? I wonder if did this. I don't know if I could pick up the CEO's body. That would have been something to check. Uh, uh, yeah, that's not good. Ran that a little too hot. Um. Yeah, okay, we have to eat the CEO's body. Mm. Yeah, we're just doing our job, you know. Running that a little too hot. Let me, let me do this. Mm -mm. Yeah, no. I know. I'm just like, I'm trying to do too much. joy of just being like really slippery <laughs> We did it! We got five star in all the levels! We did it! Mm. Mm. There we go. I'm gonna watch the finale. I never worked harder in my life for $119. Oh shit. Oh, the poor baby. There we go. The finale. Five star cat girl. Hmm. I'll spoil alert.
Bye. We did it. God damn. <laughs> Sorry, Daryl. <laughs> Do not spaghetti. No, Daryl. Daryl loves spaghetti. It's his favorite thing to do. Okay, so we got we got three achievements left. Hmm. Um. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. Three left. Uh, time out level one. Uh, make one of your coworkers throw away four trash balls within the same level, and kill every coworker in uh, level six. Well, we can do the bottom two at the same time, so let's do them. Mm. There's six. Oh, there we go. Mm. So I have to kill everybody. Well, that's... That seems like it would be... Easy to do. One. Two. Enjoy putting away these paper balls. Stupid. Mm. Oh shit. There we go. You're the janitor now. I've been trying to do the item grind stuff for Earthbound at least a bit at a time. Uh, I've been selling myself against the sharks for the pizza since I raided. Oh, gotcha. I think I can eat the CEO. Somehow. I'm level 11, no pizza. Aww. Yeah, there's some like weirdly rare drops in Earthbound. It's weird. I don't know what the rate on the pizza is, but. But some things you'd think it's just the amount of like enemies you find would, um, like, or the amount of enemies you fight, you'd think it would happen more often, I guess is what I was gonna say. <laughs> Ow, just eating everybody. Yeah, body found, I know. There's a lot of bodies, like, come on. Of course they're gonna be found. Hello. Kyle mm. hungers. How many people are- there's so many people in this stage, holy shit. What the hell? Oh. Mm. I'm kind of hoping that eventually when I do Earthbound, maybe by then Retro Treatments will somehow- uh, I know there was some- I forget who it was that mentioned it, but somebody mentioned that they might allow, like, double, like, sets where you could do a subset and a main set at the same time. So I'm kinda hoping maybe they'll have that as an option, rather than play Earthbound, like, twice in a row. Yeah. But, um, yeah, talking about it for years, yeah. 
Well, this is in the works. It's being actively worked on right now. Okay, gotcha. Uh, that'd be kind of nice. Like actual real progress was made recently. Oh, that's good to that's good to know. But it is something that I do get it. Like I get jumping in like on it now. At least with this set, uh, I can request manual unlocks for the rare drops I already got. Oh, that's that's a good idea. So so you could you could still request the manual unlocks if you've if you've gotten them in like even if you're not running that set. You know? Oh, that's that's good to know. There we go. We've, we've eaten all the coworkers. Apparently, that's that's really good to know. So we're on our last achievement. I just realized this should be clean up. Uh, yeah, but it's a hassle to do uh, more than a few. So it'd be like doing an entire subset that way would be annoying. That's fair. So this one we actually just have to time up the stage. We don't have to do really much. Oh, this is the prologue. This is when we're human. I forgot what human Kyle looks like. <laughs> The meteor from the hyperspin robot apparently it was a rare drop. Oh. Mm. Yeah, because I, I thought about it when I was playing Secret of Mana. Uh, when me and White were playing Secret of Mana, because there's a rare drop subset for that. And we did get a few of those rare drops during it, but it's just like. Yeah. I'll just go back and do it someday. It's not a big deal. Although I have to admit the the rare drops in Secret of Mana are... God. Some of them took forever. Because, mm. like, some of them you need, like, some of those orbs at the very end of the game you need, like... <laughs> you need to fucking complete the main set, so... Mm. So, we're just vibing right now for a little bit. Oh, man. Want to talk rare drops and mana and trials? Each character has a special item they need to unlock their last class and their rare drop. Oof. I see. Uh, I figure we can just chill out for five minutes. Uh, uh, as long as too upbeat uh, for how much murder there is. What are you talking about? It's the first stage. There is no murder. Uh, all is well. I just drank. It never fails. It never fails. Hydrate always gets redeemed just as I finish my water. Uh, I have like one little drop left. Uh, uh, thank you, Bahamut. It's like clockwork every time. Um. We've only been shrewing for like a little under three hours, so I suspect that we're probably going to get a little bit of Castlevania 3 in. Um, a little bit of Castlevania 3 in. We might get some Darkstalkers in. We're so close to the 1cc and Darkstalkers. Mm. Hey, Paper! How you doing? Mm. Missed a rare drop by chance in Dawn last night. Mm. Oh, it's soap! Perfect for this game that we're just finishing. Major rare drop by chance in dawn last night. Times three. 0 0.78 for the Valkyrie Soul. Damn, are you serious? I, it, I, I feel like I got really lucky on a lot of drops though, because I got two Mandragoras, um, the Valkyrie Soul. Um, there's something else that I got that I got like really quickly. Figure what it was. Um, it was rolled. It was soap. It was soap. Mm. Soap. Mm. 
been playing Deep Rock Galactic for the first time this one. Oh, how is it? I hear good things about that game. Mm. I don't know much about it, but I hear it's good. Oh, what's what are you gonna get paper? Ah, oh, skulls aren't candy. I'm sorry. This was a good game. It's a good vibes game. Yeah. So once again, for anyone that hasn't uh, hasn't tried it or picked it up, um, the wear cleaner. Uh, it's really fun. It's really fun. It's not particularly hard, but it's definitely like a good decompression game. If you're just feeling like you need a game, but not one that's like super wild, uh, wear the wear cleaner. And if you're a Platinum Hunter, or a Mastery Hunter, or whatever, Trophy Hunter, Achievement Hunter, uh, it's really simple, it's not a hard, it's not a hard Mastery, and it's honestly pretty satisfying. All the stages have a little bit of something unique to try, uh, most of the stuff is pretty straightforward. Hmm. So, not bad. Pretty, pretty good overall. I feel pretty satisfied with this one. And also, I really hope the dev, um, I hope the devs can consider making, like, a sequel, or, like, a follow-up. Like, it's, it's very cute, the game plays well, yeah. Just a good time. Yeah, so what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be moving on to uh, Dawn of Sorrow. We're gonna play a little bit more Dawn of Sorrow tonight. I know where I'm going, so that's that's good. Um, and yeah, should be should be good. Should be fun. Um, there we go. Time out on level one. There we go. That's our that's our mastery. Mm. There we go. And yeah, there we go. That's a hundred percent with the for the wear cleaner. Uh. Mm. That was a very cute game. So we can add that to our to our logs, add that to our data. So that is our hundred, or it's our fifty-six mastery of the year. So, um, that mouse pie game. Got a trailer for consoles. I don't know what that is. That mouse pie game. Mouse pie game. What does that mean? Hmm. Um. Uh, hmm. Wait. Actually, no. According to this, is their 58th. I've been behind on tracking my masteries on uh, on this. There we go. Damn. It's been a busy year. It's been a really, really busy year. Holy shit, this is all all behind. Oh my god. What the hell? 80... 121... 58. Holy shit. What the hell? What the hell? Is that correct? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8... No. Huh. Well, the more you know. Hmm. Yadi, hey Hive, how you doing? Hmm. So the wear cleaner is all done. Uh, so we're gonna be moving over to Donosoro, but uh, I'm gonna probably give uh, take a little break, give a few minutes. Uh, doing okay? I did a voting, and now I am playing base. Oh, very good. Right, good job. 
Mm. Oh. Mm. Are there elections down there right now? Is that a thing right now? Mm. Mm. Just like thinking. Um, so yeah, let's let's move our move our stuff around here a little bit. So. So we have three, maybe Dark Stalkers. I would really like to get that one CC in Dark Stalkers tonight. But it's not necessarily my priority right now. Um, but yeah, so what I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take a little break because we're three hours into the stream. Uh, it's maybe a little bit early, but yeah, that's fair. We we did juice we did just uh, play through two games so I think that's reasonable. Um, yeah, so I'll be back in about twelve minutes, and when we get back, we'll play uh, Dawn of Sorrow, and yeah. Um, after that, we'll maybe we might get a little bit of Castlevania three in, and then maybe do some Dark Stalkers. So we'll see how things go. Anyways, I. Most pie for hire is a Bioshock. Oh, I I know of that game. It's the one. Yeah, it's the rubber host style animation. Yeah, it's the one that uh, is kind of like a Mickey Mouse uh, style thing where Mickey is um, uh, what's it called? Um, um public domain uh, now. So it's a game that's kind of leaning on that style. Hmm. 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 Uh, got a trailer for console. Uh, I think it's just because, like, it's a first-person game, so it's like, it's not super high on my radar, but hey, I imagine it's probably gonna hit for some people. It's a very different idea, so. That's, that's always good to see. Hmm. All right. So, I'm gonna go on a quick break, uh, I'll be back in a few minutes, uh, everyone hang tight, enjoy the clip show in the meantime, and when we get back, Donna So, yeah, catch y'all in a few, here be! Um. I've had enough of these bats, biting me on the ass. My luxurious Belmont ass! Look at him hunt. The tracking. Oh! Oh my god, he is- Whoa! Oh, this version's so fucking weird. I got bounced on his head. What? That's so weird. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Buttercoochie, gosh. D I was just about to say, this better not be a donation- No! <laughs> Pearl, Pearl. Well, thank you. Thank you for the big donation. Stop it. Stop it. I know what y'all doing. Stop it. I should build another shrimp mobile. Like, I generally don't mind, like, walking around in this game. Because I think it's very... Oh, fuck. <laughs> That's deep water. <laughs> I thought that was just, like, shallow. I can't believe I drowned the shrimp mobile. <laughs> oh jeez, it might be hard to get out of here. What? What do you mean the shrimp mobile doesn't swim? The puddle is three feet deep and you go for a swim. How you doing? Ahoy! 
Oh, that's a wall. Oh, I'm, I'm air up. What is... I have no idea what flinched me, but I guess I need flinch free. I guess I'm a flinch E more than a flinch er now. What the fuck? Oh. I only ate a fireball. Whoa, that was really close. I don't remember someone fireball last time. And the thing is, so I anyways, mean, it's haunting me. This isn't I, good. I, this isn't I good. I can use a life powder. I don't have one. Sorry. I got gotcha. you. I don't. Oh my god! It saved you. That is wild. How did I fucking survive that? Was it life powder? I, my, did you? I, I life powdered you, and then that was just yeah. enough to refresh wow. your guts. Wow. That's what happened. I don't have guts. <laughs> What? Well, okay, well, I don't know how you survived that. I don't know how you survived lucky. that. What the fuck? Actually, now that I think about how it. How are you alive? I know! I'm even upset. There was a sick save, though. Thank you. <laughs> uh, No, we're not making a call. No call. No call. <laughs> uh, ultra lovable troublemakers, it is. No. That's not what we are. We're not a cult. No, no cults. No cults. No cults. Try not to have cults. Why are we, why are we all forming cults? I just, I just want to hang out. Also, I don't know why the emotes are like doubling up. I feel like I must have two swords. Well, good thing I... Whoa, jeez. What is this little guy running up here? Oh. Ah. Uh, oh. Don't do that. Oh. Oh. Ashley, you gotta get behind me, cause you're you're like in the danger zone right now. You're in the splash zone. Ah! Ashley. Ara ara, no. Nah, cross like purple whip, but better. Okay. It's kind of less spammable, though. Ooh. And if you miss with it, you end up in those kind of situations. Oh, there we go. Oh, shit. Sorry. I'm still zoomed in. Oh. I guess that's not it. Oh! <laughs> what did I do? Um, I think I warped myself back? Secret area? Did I? I think I accidentally did a map skip. This doesn't, this looks like a later part of the map. Will they interact with anything? What happened? Oh, this is not good. Um, what? Um, um, I guess I will just die now. Uh, yeah, for some reason I'm not able to interact with anything. Let's, well, shit, so this is what happens when you die. This is why we don't play a one life mode. I mean, uh, let, me, let me be free. I know, I know that's where it is. Well, this is awful. I'm gonna die, I'm going into the furnace. Oh. Yeah, thanks, I hate this. Let me in. Uh, beep, beep, beep. What? I just got the ability to interact with things. No! It hurt. That hurt. I bet it did.
Make up your mind what you're doing! <laughs> What? Go away! I'm busy! Uh. Ow, fuck! Seriously? How did, how did that even hit? Oh. No! Return fire! That was... Is Sagat's, like, projectile <laughs> negative on hit? <laughs> he hit us and then we just fucking shot at the token back before his arms are down. <laughs> oh, uh, yeah. Maybe they didn't make it in turret hell. Oh, yeah. But to <laughs> Oh no! My game's dying! It was too much! <laughs> what? I just... I just need a picture of this. Double door crash! The cheeks touched and crashed the game! Time, mm -hmm. At the time the Wii came out, yeah. I was I was a I was a freshman in college yeah. at, at at DigiPen Institute of Technology, which at the time was renting out one of its buildings oh. from uh, the Nintendo uh, in oh. in a in a in a NSI yeah. thing, yeah. and uh, like for a period of of two, two days, yeah. if you if you took the fire escape out the back. You could get a free entrance into a warehouse where a lot of Wii's were being stored. <laughs> and I'm not saying that I ever stole one, but, you know, maybe some people did, and I was a beneficiary. Oh. Oh my god! <laughs> I'm channeling my inner Bowser. I gotta be the Bowser on the bridge. <laughs> this is my bridge. My Bowser fucking falls into the lap. I gotta, I gotta take a different character. Who who guards a bridge but succeeds? Yeah, you know, whatever. I don't care. Oh my god. The cow. The cow helped us in the end. Oh, we got an emerald. You Hell okay? yeah. yeah. Ow, fuck! Ow! <laughs> ah, jeez! <laughs> Why is the cow like this? Oh my god, it incapacitated Ashley again! <laughs> I love this cow. Oh my god. Playing arcade games. Playing through as many arcade games as we can on a single set. Oh! Holy fuck! Did y'all hear that? It's thundering here right now. Am I still online? <laughs> wow. That was that was loud. That was really close. I'm not even gonna lie, everything turned off here briefly and my computer didn't shut off. That's how like Yeah, I'm okay. Wow. I did hear that. It sounded like a bucket falling over. That was the loudest, like, bolt I've ever heard. Holy fuck. Wow. Um, OBS didn't drop. <laughs> My stream didn't drop from that. 
The power went out. How does it even happen? <laughs> like everything, everything turned off. I was like, ah, oh, fuck. Are you kidding me? Man, it was like point blank too. Oh, did you see that? They shot two of them. Oh my god. Hey, there's a thing over there. I wonder what that is. Like, what's over here? Oh. Ha! Oh. Six playthroughs. Six playthroughs. And we discovered the swag blade on the space elevator. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, my life is better already. Power of swag. Oh. Oh my god. Oh. What a blessing. Swag strats. Oh my gosh. Unbelievable. Oh my god, my quality of life. <laughs> Through the roof. Say so he looks the size of a small cactar, but I can't tell there's nothing there's nothing to scale him, so I have no idea how big he is. He's very big. If that's if that's a, like Maybe that chair is small, but it's probably a normal sized chair. Oh, he's so big. Oh, he's a hundred dollars. That's so many dollars. But I really like him. But he's a hundred dollars, so probably, probably not a good idea. But he's very cute. But he's like three. Say he looks the size of a small cactar, but I can't tell. There's nothing, there's nothing to scale him. So I have no idea how big he is. He's very big. If that's if that's a, like maybe that chair is small, but it's probably a normal sized chair. Oh, he's so big. Oh, he's a hundred 